Hello, today I want to show you the capabilities of GoCater sensor with a built-in GoPixel software and it's featured on how to measure and evaluate foot or, in this example, chicken breast. Here you see the scanning process of the chicken breast in slow motion with a 2440 widely used in food industry applications. The sensor generates 3D data that we can view in the sensor's web UI. The height data is shown color-coded, ready to be fed into the sensor's built-in tools for further evaluation. There are multiple tools available for evaluation. Let's see a few of them. Blob tool, for instance, extract targets and use configurable morphological operations to better isolate parts. It calculates several parameters such as the position, the area, and the extracted 3D data can be used as an input for further tools. Another useful tool is the ellipse tool. It gives the major axis and dimensions and rotation angle. The surface volume tool calculates the volume of the part, its area, and gives the thickness to maximum height or to average height. Bounding box catches the part with a rectangle area and calculates the dimension of that rectangle and gives you also the orientation angle. The segmentation tool separates surface data into segments based on the tool parameters. Segments can be touching or overlapping to a certain degree. The segmentation tool is especially useful in the foot industry. For example, to identify foot items that are too small or too big or items that are damaged. For each segment, the tool returns positions of its center, length and width and its area, and some other more global parameter. To pick up the part, surface position is the tool that calculates a center point. The center point can be selected based on different features, like on the average of the part, median, centroid, or on a minimum or maximum Z position. Robot pose outputs position and rotational values based on geometric features. Thank you for watching.